We are at the entry point, Stewart River. Got the boats ready, Scott and Dad are ready to go. Everything's ready, we're gonna head down the long portage. Oh, they put a new sign up. Wilderness boundary beyond this sign. There we go. Looky here, lady slippers, Scott. Got some lady slippers. We found a muskeg. Look at that, look at Scotty's sandals. Some souvenirs for later here. <laughs> Paying good money uh, in the cities to uh, get the, uh, the mud treatment, right? Oh uh, yeah, right. Photo op. Made to Stewart River. Uh, now we're gonna push on. I haven't talked about it at all yet, but we brought a tandem and we brought a solo canoe since there's three of us. Figured that'd be a little more fun. It sucks fishing three guys in a tandem canoe, so yeah, so we got the solo. Scotty's gonna take the solo here for this stretch of river. Yep. Pretty portage along the Stewart River. Christy, I think he's fallen in love with solo canoes. We made it to Stewart Lake. Now, we're gonna go see if we can find a campsite. Everybody's soaked, but the blue sky is coming out. So hopefully we can dry off and catch a little sun. Scotty's coming down the trail with the solo canoe. Were you up there taking pictures of the waterfall? Yep. Nice. So, where are we, Scotty? Where are we? Stewart Lake <laughs> <laughs> at the Taj Mahal campsite, man. This is the best campsite I've been to in a while. Yeah, it's a nice site we landed. We landed the site on the northwest end of uh, Stewart Lake, but we could have had any one of them because we've got this entire lake to ourselves. That's gonna be mashed potatoes. grill up these steaks so that's dinner tonight steak and mashed potatoes then we're gonna get out and we're gonna go out on this lake and do some fishing you going for it yep not that far away can you see us over there can you see us Hi, 
I told him not to expect that every time. <laughs> <laughs> Toad. Yo. Oh, that's a little guy too. Oh, I thought you said tone. <laughs> same size as the one on the, uh, yeah, it's almost the same size. Maybe a smidge bigger. No, they're the same dang size. Uh, I'm on the board. God, we don't even need to anchor, Scotty. <laughs> Look at this glass. Dead calm. I got him. There's something wrong. <laughs> you got the net, actually. That's all right. Yeah. That one's got a little more fight. You got the net, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah, that one's a nicer fish. Oh, trophy. Oh, your leech. Oh, man. Leech is right there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> nice fish. Yeah, I got another one. We're filling out a stringer here. Did you lose them? Yep. I was just grabbing the line. It was right. Ah, damn it. And I lost my leech. You need a net? No. Okay. These gnats are really pissing me off. Yeah. Yeah, if we weren't for catching fish, we probably wouldn't be here. Well, I think there'd be gnats in there. Oh! Fish on! Got the net, I believe. Way to go. Jeez, really up. Oh, I pulled it right out of his mouth. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> I get the stringer. <laughs> well, I got him. Yeah, you got him. Barely. Look at that. You threw the hook again. You should have a trophy for a littlest fish. Scotty's got one on here. Need the net? Oh, here. Sorry. There you go. Sorry, I didn't get any footage of this, but we were having some breakfast wraps for breakfast with some uh, egg skillet, jerky, bacon, and tortillas with a little hot sauce.
Oh, making a run for it. Look at this. Monday afternoon, it's a campsite over there. We blew up onto this island. Hooked into a couple of fish here this morning that we're gonna fillet up for a true shore lunch. Boundary waters. Got to keep the, got to keep the filet man happy. <laughs> yes. Oh, you got through it there. You need more food. Come on, come on. <laughs> All right. So we spent the last 45 minutes or so getting our filets ready here, and Uncle fire up the ready. stove here in a second. We've got our expert filleter Dave over there. Tony is the stove man this time, and I am the batter boy. All right. Fish fries underway. And we're gonna wash it down with some homebrew. Copper ale. Can't wait. Hear me. Hear me. So uh, Tony just set up his chair right by the edge of the water in a big gust of wind. Came up and uh, blew it into the lake. Mm, how would you describe this? Strump girl the <laughs> Fish fry time. With two knives. Oh. Got some rice to go with it. Good time. Look at them fins. <laughs> Eat it. Yep. Pull the fins. Devour it. Yep. You just pull the. You can pull the fins clean. There it is. Oh yeah. Bingo. What do you think? Oh yes. Oh, I oh. saw the vapes. <laughs> oh, the vapes. <gasps> Here, uh, I'll, hold it. It. I'll hold it. I'll hold the bottle around. <laughs> oh, here, my cup's got some shit in it. Oh, it's dark. It's copper ale. Mm. Cheers. Thank you. Right. All right, don't let it spill, Tony. God, no. I'll be I'll be licking the rock if it does. Yes. Cheers, Gross. boys. said this morning. What'd you say? Oh, good. That oh, really good. I'm just taking in a... <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, wow, that's good. Yeah. Oh, fat tire-ish. Yeah. yeah, that's good. That's mm. good, Scotty. Alright, man, let's eat. Alright, brood it for you guys back in, like, March, I think. Oh, look at that. Alright. I got some rice with a little bit of. I always get a picture of the fish fry, beer, and the rice plate. Fish. Fish. Mm, walleye fish fry. Well, that's another wing. Yep. Two wings for me, I guess. You want another wing? No. Good? But if there's a cheek in there, I'll take one of them. Yep. Yeah, I, I never grabbed a cheek, Here's so. A cheek. Okay, thank you. Yep. Here's and this is our five-star campsite with the fantastic landing here. The 
pine needle carpet. Got a tent back there. Nice view out to the southeast, Stewart Lake. All right, it's about eight o'clock on Tuesday morning. We're having some breakfast. Scotty's got his vanilla pudding with granola. And so I just mix mine up. Oh God, it's good. Who'd have thought some pudding and granola for breakfast would be the talk of the town, but I don't know, who picked out this granola, Scotty? It's scrum diddly up just. It was Rebecca. <laughs> oh, Rebecca. She's got good taste oh. in granola. Rebecca, you made my morning. <laughs> made it. Morning made, thanks to Rebecca. Oh, that's good. Scotty brought some margaritas. We're drinking margaritas. Oh. The boundary water. Oh God! Cantina oh right my here, goodness! Right that lake is like glass. Yeah, that's Canada over there, by the way. Right there, right in that. there. That's Canada. Well, we just set up camp here on uh, Iron. Got a lake that's facing, or a campsite's facing straight north. So uh, this is one of the last ones available. So I set my tent up on that rock outcropping. Hopefully the uh, sun doesn't come beating in uh, super early in the morning. Got Tony and Dave working on some water up there. They got their tent set up right there. I think we're gonna hydrate up here as soon as that water's done and hopefully get out and wet a line. Got it? Yep. That was weird. That's gotta be a walleye. I don't have the net, unfortunately. And if that thing, if it, Sorry, Scotty. That's all right. You want me to get out there and... Oh, wow. it might be a pike. I don't know if I got a very good hook set on him. Well, pump it. Oh, uh, that would... Oh, yeah, that's a big... That's a big fish. Oh, it's a big smallie. It is? Yeah, it's a big smallie. <laughs> She's a beaut! <laughs> oh, I got your tat. Yeah, nice landing job, Scotty. Wow, nice fish. Thanks, pal. Oh, look at that baby. That's a nice smallie. Be a nice close up.
Ooh, making a run, making a run. Oh, he's down there. Oh my Ooh. God, what was that? That was an oiler or a muskie. What That's a goofy looking walleye. I think it's a sauger. Is it a white spot on the tail? No. Does it have like a white belly? Yes. Yeah. It's got no white spot on its tail. Yeah. Been a long time since I've caught a sauger. All right, I got the net ready. Pulling some drag, huh? Yeah, I think it is too. This is wild rice soup. I just poured in chunks of fish that we caught today. And to go with it, dinner rolls, carrots. that refreshing although I realized I got a little bit of sunburn on my arms <laughs> but holy crap the water is great Here we are checking out the campsite on the west end of Three Island and Dad found a nice stone lounge chair that he's hanging out in. tree behind me more. Look at that. Nice view. We're at the bottom of Curtin Falls and uh, we're leaving Dad here to fish. He's got a bobber out there. You can see the moving water over that way. And uh, we're gonna leave him here and go, Scotty and I are gonna go up to Crooked Lake. We're gonna portage up to Crooked and we're gonna go check out some pictographs that I didn't know existed up there. All right, it's Thursday. And we're at Curtin Falls, as you can tell. Great, clear, sunny day. We came up here on Tuesday night. Kind of walked around a little bit right at sunset. for everybody at home. Are. 
There's definitely some swirlies on the left here. You see that, Scott? Yep, I do actually. That's a better fish. Yeah. Ooh. Scotty just boated a Iron Lake smallmouth. That's a beauty. It's She's a, a slab, beaut. man. Look at the nice color. Nice it's and beaut, dark. Clark. She's a beaut. No, it's a smallie. No, it's a walleye. Oh, you want me to net it? Yeah, yes, I do. All right, we caught, uh, caught some lunch today. It's right here at Curtin Falls. The most scenic spot to do a uh, shore lunch. We say there, boys. Successful day. Very successful. Delicious day. Delicious day. <laughs> well, it's our last night on iron. Tomorrow. We're paddling back for Stewart Lake. Breakfast. It's breakfast time. Beautiful day on Iron Lake. We got water going on the stove. Personally, I'm going to have a little hot cocoa in my cup. Oh boy, a lot of hot cocoa. That came out kind of fast. Ooh, there's sausage in this one. Sausage. There's sausage and there's hash browns in, in it. We're leaving Iron Lake today and the wind just picked up like crazy. And it is nuts out here. But nuts but doable.
last night of our trip, last full day. We made it back to Stewart Lake. The wind is just whipping out on this lake. We got white caps everywhere. All right, so I was saying we're back on Stewart on the, uh, we're on the point campsite that's on the north, northeast end of the lake, kind of. First walleye in the solo canoe. Got a light tapper right here. Very light tap. Another walleye here. There we go. Alright. Holy cow, that guy hit really light. Just about lost the paddle. There we go. Look at that. Nice job. I got one. Oh. That's, that's, it's decent, it's decent. Oh shit, I just dropped my rod in the lake. God dang it. Thank you. 